developing behind me. Just please try to ignore it. I've been doing so many crazy things lately that I haven't really um, made my bed too well. So yeah, but today I have a haul for you guys and um, I know I feel like I do a lot of hauls but they're like so easy to film and I don't know, I just like filming hauls. So if you get tired of them, let me know down below. But otherwise, I think I'll keep filming them when I buy stuff. So this is a collective haul. This wasn't like an all-in-one-day haul or anything like that. But I'll start out with the clothes. I got stuff from Hot Look, Vanity, and Target, and a bunch of stuff from Forever 21. So I'll start out with my Hot Look thing. And I got these Juicy Couture sweatpants, because Juicy Couture was on Hot Look the other day. And like, I don't know if they're supposed to be doing it, but there's like little, I don't know if you can see that, it's like ripping right here, like, I don't know if it's supposed to do that, but, yeah, and they just say so juicy on them, and I got them, I think, for like 44 something, um, and they're usually, well, they're usually more than that, that's all I know, so, I was pretty excited about these, and they have glitter on them, and glitter kind of goes everywhere when those were washed, but anyways, so now I'm gonna... I'm going to reach behind me to grab these things. So, um, I got this pair of red skinny jeans from Target, and I believe they were like $25, something like that. Um, but yeah, they're just your basic red skinny jeans, and they're super awesome, and I love them. And I was going to get a pair of the mint ones too, but I didn't have that much money left, so I just got the red pair. And then... From Vanity, I just got this really pretty maxi dress, and, oh, it's this way. It's just got a little, um, I can't think of what kind of neckline that is. Here's what it looks like off the hanger. It's just got that kind of neckline, neckline and I think I'll probably wear, like, a, um, tank top or something under it. And the back's just got this weird, like, tied, ropey look. I don't know, but it's a maxi dress, so it goes really far and it's super cute on and it was so flattering and honestly like I'd never considered buying a maxi dress until I bought this and I was super glad that I bought it and for Forever 21 okay the first thing I got is a shirt that I'm wearing and it's just got these little it's like a turquoise color and it's got these little um circular like little circles that are like scribbled um I have a outfit of the week coming up and you'll probably see most of these clothes on me that throughout that week so yeah today was the first day of my outfit of the week so you'll probably see my clothes on me soon so yeah because I'll probably be wearing majority of these clothes over the next few days oh this is so cute I wore this yesterday it's kind of wet because I took it out of the dryer and it wasn't fully dry but it's just like this teary tiered ruffly shirt and if you have like a belly or just like a little bit of a belly pooch I don't know how to say it but and you want to like cover these up ruffles are like the greatest things ever because they just make it look like flat but you have ruffles um I don't know how to explain it but they look really it looks adorable adorable on so I really like it um I got a lot of basic things from Prepper 21 uh one of the basic things I got was just this like it's not really I don't know it's, it's a razorback but it's like a flowy razorback so it's not like a tight razorback shirt but it's just this coral color and I mean these are very essential especially during summer when you just want to throw something on and not get too dressed up or anything so I really like this and I think it was only like four dollars or something like 480 I'm not even sure and then I got this dress which almost I feel like makes me look like a housewife or something I don't know but it's got these little um bows on it if you can see it up close and it had a brown belt but I don't think I'm actually gonna wear the brown belt because it was kind of tight I don't know it was an awkward shape feeling belt and it's just a short little dress and it's really cute on um I don't know I really like it I also got this strapless dress from forever 21 and it's just got these little like stripey interesting colored pattern going on and it's super cute and I wore it a couple days ago um I really like it and it fits really well and it's really comfortable and I feel like in the summer comfort is so important because otherwise you're like I mean it's summer you don't have to get all dressed up every day. You can throw on a dress that will make you look dressier, but feel comfortable. That's what I like about dresses. So, I got that. Oh, and here's another essential, essential shirt. And it's just like a periwinkle um, v-neck t-shirt. I have all white v-necks, and I love wearing v-necks because they are like amazingly comfortable, and they're just awesome. So, I got this periwinkle v-neck, and I think this one was also like 480 or something. 
um, essentials from Forever 21 are usually pretty cheap. And then I got this shirt, and it might look, it's probably like really bright, bright, you're probably going to blind, but it's like a lime green color, and you can probably see that they're like striped, and it's like a lighter lime green and a darker lime green, and it is super cute, and it's like kind of a slouchier shirt, so it's bigger and flowy, and I really like flowy shirts just because I'm kind of insecure, and flowy shirts just make me feel better. So, I had sunglasses. I don't know where they are, but I got two pairs of sunglasses from Vanity just because I'm a sunglass addict. Um, they're really nothing special. One's just a brown pair and one's a white pair with like floral pattern on the side. But yeah, so I don't know where those are at, which is probably not a good thing because I just bought them. But anyways, moving on ugh, to Bath and Body Works. Now, I can only show you guys like part of this stuff because the rest of it is for my giveaway that I'll be doing and also okay really fast let me know down below because I have my makeup and my bath and body works like my candles are in here but like my like lotions and stuff in my in the, the other room it's my brother's bedroom but he doesn't live here anymore because he's like grown and whatever but he's actually staying with us this summer before he moves to Pennsylvania so uh, but yeah, so my makeup and all that stuff is in his room because I didn't really have very much space in my room. So I'm actually going to be redoing part of my room and having room to put, like, my Bath and Body Works stuff in here and, like, my makeup and whatever. So I'm contemplating if I want to do that Bath and Body Works collection um, with the giveaway when I have my stuff in this room. Or do, like, one collection in there and do a giveaway and then do an updated one and do another giveaway with Bath and Body Works because... Um, they're gonna have a huge sale. I don't know. I have like a thing for it. It's like the big semi-annual sale with up to 75% off on June 13th and I could probably get a lot of stuff from that. So let me know down below if you want me to do like one big collection and just like wait and do it all here and wait until after June 13th so I can do a bigger giveaway or do two separate giveaways and do both collections. I don't know. So yeah, let me know down below because yeah, that was probably really scatterbrained. But anyways, it might take me a minute to figure out what is what. But this is mine, <laughs> and it is a body mist, and or fine fragrance mist, I guess. I don't even think they sell the old style of body mist anymore, but that's okay. Um, this is in Wildberry Tulips, and oh my god, Wildberry Tulips smells amazing. Like, it's my new favorite scent, but they always have those, like, Wildberry, whatever, and then they don't have them for a really long time. So, oh god. I love it. I probably should have stocked up on these because they're not going to have it forever, obviously. And I really, really liked it. And I also got it in the lotion, too, because it smells so good. Ah, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Okay. And then I'm obsessed with Bath & Body Works body butter for my legs after I shave or after I get out of the shower, whatever. Um, and I had the Paris Amour body butter and I was out of it so I had to pick up another one and it smells so good like I love the Paris Amour scent um, oh, and I love the way it looks like, when you first open it it's like so perfect and you don't want to like touch it ah oh, I love it but yeah the body butter like if you feel like your legs get really dry after you shower or after you shave or whatever this is like intense moisturizer so it works really really well so I really like this and then, okay, this is mine too, actually. And then I got the Malibu Heart, which is like their new, um, new fragrance or whatever. Uh, it smells really, really good. I really like it. Although it might give me a headache, I'm not sure yet, which makes me really sad because it smells awesome. But, yeah, so this one is really cool. Got that. And then let's see here. Those are for the giveaway. And then I got this Bally Mango, just like mini, in the like 3 for 10 minis or whatever, and it smells so good. I've never smelled Bally Mango before, to be completely honest, and I'm kind of obsessed. It smells really freaking good. And then everything else except for this candle in here is for my giveaway. Uh, but this is the Peach Bellini candle, and I haven't really gotten a lot of candles from... Um, the kind of spring and summer collection. I think I have Coco Lobo and um, Fresh Something Apples for my bathroom, but because I like that smell for the bathroom, I don't know. But this is awesome. 
Oh my god. I love peach smells. I love, I just love peaches in general, I guess, and I really love how this smells. Like, it's awesome. You should check it out. I really like pink sangria, too, which is kind of a favorite, but what sucks is that it gives me a terrible headache. Like, it smells so good, but the minute I smell it, my head just hurts so bad. But this, I'm really glad, doesn't hurt my head. And it even says down here, it says, A sweet twist on a classic blend of white peach, yellow mandarin, and black currant. With jasmine and a splash of juicy orange. So, oh my god, it smells so good. It kind of reminds me of that Jingle Bellini, like, lotion they had um, around the time of New Year's or whatever. And I still have that. It's my favorite lotion ever. I hope they have it again next year because I've used, like, a lot. But that's besides the point. So anyways, I hope you guys um, enjoyed my haul because I'm pretty sure that's all I got. Yep, yeah, that's definitely all I got. So I hope you guys enjoyed my haul. And if you want to see more hauls like this, and let me know down below. Um, if you don't want to see any more hauls, then tell me down below. But don't just dislike it. I don't know. I don't like dislikes. I don't think anybody does. But yeah. I don't know. So thank you guys so much for watching my haul today. And if you have any video requests, please let me know down below because it's summer and I have so much time to record and film and whatever and edit and just spend the wee hours of the morning editing, which is what I did all last summer. And I'm really hoping that my videos have really gotten better lately. I don't know. I've tried to make my videos better. Um, I think my quality for one and the fact that my videos are like really small like I don't know why if anybody knows why my videos are doing that where there's like it's like not filling up the whole frame and it's just like a tiny in, like inside the square and there's like a black ring around the outside I don't know why it's doing that and it really makes me mad because I want it to be like full screen or like the full square and it's not so if you guys have any suggestions on how I can fix that please let me know and I am gonna get a new camera and I'm thinking I, it's like so expensive but I really want the Canon T3i and it's so expensive but I want it, and my parents might help me get it, like, for my birthday or whatever, so that might be a while away before, a while, <laughs> a while away before I get, um, a new camera, but I really want a new camera, so I'm hoping that I can get it, and maybe I'll just, like, give up spending money on clothes and makeup for the next, like, three months and just buy the camera, which I might do that, but I need money for my giveaways that I plan on doing in the future so yeah if you're not subscribed already and you like this video please subscribe because I am planning on doing a Mac giveaway when I get to 800 subscribers I might go down to 700 subscribers soon when I do that I don't know it's really hard to reach my goal I don't know what it is like ah. okay help me improve my videos first of all you guys but just give me some tips down below and help me out so yeah thank you guys for watching and I love you all very much bye guys